hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do a six month preview. Well, not a preview, a six month. Where are you going to be in six months from now? That's what it is. Where six months from now? This is for Libra, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Six months from now. So six months from the date that you watch this. So yeah, six months from now. What do we got for Libra? We're going to get a couple of these. I don't know how many, however many I decide. And then we are going to use this deck over here. You probably can't see. I don't think I have it on the camera. But anyway, six months from now for Libra. Okay, six months. Whew, that's quite a few. But, you know, I can't say no because when that happens, it just seems like it has to happen. Vulture. Oh, son of a gun. Depression, anxiety, worry that someone is against you. So you may be worried. You may be worried. Yep. Let's see what these have to say. Ladder, climbing toward success. Purse, pay attention to your finances. Goldfish, increase in material wealth or spiritual growth. So there's going to be, you are climbing, climbing a ladder, so that's good. Lily, spiritual love. So we got some sort of spiritual thing happening here. Fan, romance, celebration, or party. So in six months from now, you are going to be in a pretty good place. But you're worried. You're going to still be worried, right? Because you don't trust. You don't trust anybody. You are climbing the ladder. There's going to be an increase in money or spiritual growth. There's some sort of spiritual love here. You definitely got to pay attention to your finances. Don't overspend. You're going to be something to do with love. Going to a celebration or something. Having fun. A feeling loved, uh, getting a lot of attention. I think we got something going on here that um, looks pretty good to me. For Libra. And climbing the ladder towards success. This is beautiful. Love, romance, a celebration. But worried about it. Worried, not uh, distrustful, right? Pay attention to your finances. Uh, you look fine. Don't have to worry about any of that. These cards are just a flipping. That was just flipped right out. Yikes. Two of Cups reverse. I'm going to focus this in in just a second. Let me get started here. Six months from now. Hmm. Eight of Pentacles, Two of Cups reversed, Four of Swords reversed, the Emperor right around the corner. Now this is right around the corner. So if you are single, you are going to, you have this person that is in your vicinity. This is a, this is a boss. This is a uh, true king. This is a leader. This is um, somebody that is in an authoritative position. This could be you. If you were the masculine, this is you in control. This is very much in control. Dominating. Dominating the scene. Very structured and organized. Now, for some of you, if this is work-related, you could become a boss or a supervisor. Just saying. Hmm. Six months from now. Interesting. I don't know who this Queen of Wands is, but she and the Queen of Cups keeps coming up in your reading. It came up in the one I just did for March as well, the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Wands. But on the bottom, we have leaving the past hurts behind. So you are going to be healing. You're healing from a situation. I feel as though dropping something, making a conscious change, putting in effort um, to drop something that doesn't serve you. Something has weighed you down. Something has. Something has weighed you down. 
Um, but now it's like, now there's wasted time. It's like maybe there's somebody's realizing that they wasted some time. Um, somebody may be feeling powerless. Somebody could be losing their control over you. Okay, this is a very controlling energy and this is a loss of power. Um, now the Three of Wands reversed is uh, wasted time, not seeing the opportunities. I think there's a lack of self-love here or you haven't been getting the love that you deserve. The tender loving care. Um, something to do with a father as well. Maybe there's a there's a hard time healing. And I don't know if there's been some sort of... Uh, I mean, we have the Four of Swords here. If there's been a death or there's something has ended, you know, and you've been blocking your emotions. But this is healing. The Three of Swords reverse is healing from a situation. So six months from now, I think that you will be... I honestly feel like you will be in a better place, even though you may feel like... Um, you may be burying yourself in your work. You know, you're working on something. You're you're not really focused on a relationship. You're not focused on um, a partner, right? You're focused on yourself right now. I think that you are probably blocking your emotions, though, in six months. There's some sort of no contact, so no communication um, with somebody. And this could be with um, somebody that was very controlling of you is like you were under somebody else's control and I think the challenge now is finding your self confidence, finding your self esteem, your your self value of some way. I think that you've been under somebody's control and you're not feeling very maybe you're not feeling lovable. Uh, and 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 I, and I and I'm sad to say that because I mean we have the Queen of Cups reverse this is somebody that is you know, can't master their emotions, may may see themselves as a victim, may cry a lot. It may be a, a time of emotion, okay? Six months from now, you may be feeling emotional because you've been under somebody's control, somebody's power. There's a lot of control manipulation here. With the Queen of Sor uh, Wands reverse and the Queen of, I mean, the Magician reverse, this is a master manipulator here. It's like you've been manipulated by somebody, in a masterful way, okay? And I feel like this person has really stolen your energy. Look at all these wands reversed. Wands are energy. Wands are drive. Wands are ambition, confidence, self-esteem. And somebody has brought you down. They've made you feel uh, like you're not lovable or like it was your fault. They've placed blame on you. They made, you know, they didn't want to be held accountable for their actions. They, It's like they really stole your your desire, your energy, your ambition. They, they, they made you feel less than worthy. And that's really not okay. It's really not. I do feel as though um, that is over. I think there's exhaustion, major exhaustion, uh, frustrations. There could be some sort of illness. Maybe you're, 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 it's like you need time to recuperate. You're, you're going through a period of healing over a partnership. And this could have to do with a parent. It could have to be with a parent. Maybe it's a father or a mother. This is a father and this is a mother. So it could be a father, mother kind of thing. And it's like there's been some sort of split or departure. And, and now you're making conscious changes to drop the baggage that this person left you with. This person left you with a lot of baggage. They left you with a lot of questions, right? They left you with a lot of, of feelings of, I'm not good enough where you are. You are good enough. So anyway, I think that six months from now, you are going to start to, you know, bring order back to your life. I think that you're going to take control. You're going to start to feel more, more um, stable, okay? Um, you are probably now going to be taking on more of a leadership position. You're in the lead. You're the boss now. Now you're, you're probably seeing that. But it's still very emotional because I think that there's there's been some sort of, baggage that has been dropped like this heavy weight is 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 slipping away and this could actually be weight okay some of you are losing weight it, like weight but it doesn't have to be there's been some dead weight that you have been holding on to but this dead weight is being lifted okay so i think that this in six months from now you are probably not really communicating because you're healing from something that has really hurt you it has it has I mean, when you get the Four of Swords reversed, this is health issues, frustration, exhausted, tired, um, overtired. It's like, it's very emotional. It's an emotional time. And I think it's emotional because there's been some sort of split, 
Okay, the Two of Cups reversed. And this split uh, has made you very... You know, maybe you're feeling like you're a victim here. You know what I mean? Like you're a victim. And this is, I mean, you get the Queen of Wands in reversed. The Queen of Wands reversed is somebody that is weak. Okay, this person is weak. This person throws tantrums. This person has a, is melodramatic. You know what I mean? So I'm not sure if you're taking on that energy or you were dealing with a person who gave you their energy. You know what I mean? You may have been dealing with somebody that was very nasty okay and this person taught you some bad behavior okay there, there is definitely some bad behavior here anyway six months from now i see that you are feeling powerless you are feeling powerless because of something in your past yeah you're in some sort of pain you are in, you're in some sort of pain still you are now it's upright it's like there's a painful separation when you get the three of swords and i do see a painful separation and i think the separation happens before it that doesn't happen in this month it may happen in march okay it may happen in april march or april okay it may have happened before that it may have happened years before could be up to eight years before um but there's some sort of pain that you are suffering, and it's a suffering of a separation, separation of some sort, suffering, painful separation. Now there's no communication, there's no contact, and there's nothing you can do to change it, you know? It's like you didn't see it. You didn't see it. This is not what you wanted to happen, obviously. So I see that there's a contact or communication that is no more and there's nothing you can do. It's done. It's over. Um, there's been some, some malicious behavior. It's like somebody was weighing you down. They were holding you down. This person was very controlling, but people didn't see it. But the universe did. Interesting. Six months. What's around the corner? Moving. Moving to a better place. But it's very emotional. When you get the Queen of Cups and reversed, it is definitely emotional. Drowning in emotions. I think it is definitely going to be an emotional time because somebody has moved on. And I don't know if it's a husband or a partner or a father. Somebody has moved on. It's very, very emotional. It could be a father figure. Now, moving to a better place. Taking a new approach. Oh, my goodness. There's definitely emotional <laughs> outburst here. It's definitely going to be an emotion. Six months from now, you're going to be definitely feeling... Uh, you're going to be... It's emotional, okay? With the Queen of Cups reverse and the Chariot reverse, it's unable to master emotions. This is running into a disaster. Maybe there's been some sort of disaster. I don't know if somebody has passed because of this Four of Swords. The 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 Chariot reversed that is um, out of control. It's emotions all over the place. With the Queen of Cups reversed underneath it, definitely. And this is something coming to a dead stop. And this one is too. So somebody is, something is coming, is going to be, something is coming to a dead stop. And you can't, there's nothing you can do about it. There's a higher power involved. You think about the emperor. That's, that's somebody in authority that is making a decision. The decision is made. There's nothing you can do. The choice has been made. Seriously, and then with the with the with the magician reverse, that's just powerless. You're powerless to the situation. Knight of Cups reverse. That's definitely going to be emotional. I think that you're, there's it is there's a painful separation that is happening, and it's happening. 
I don't know if it's happening six months from now or if it's happening now and you're still feeling it six months from now. There is some sort of emotional loss here. Somebody didn't follow through. They lied. The magician reversed this as a master manipulator, a pathological liar. For sure. Could be dealing with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, Gemini, Cancer. Aries. Father figure. We definitely have a very prominent father figure here. This father figure or husband maybe leaving this alpha it's an alpha male something comes to a dead stop you know there could even be and i don't like to say this all the time but if this is a car and this is like a vehicle too it's like running in there could be some sort of accident there could be there could be or somebody could just be leaving they're departing and it's sad there's definitely a lot of sadness here but this was this was very burdensome and there was a lot, a lot of baggage attached to this partnership anyway. Partnership, baggage, burden, it needed to go. So anyway, I feel like six months from now, you are probably going to be uh, wanting to retreat by the looks of things with this eight of wands. Not wanting to communicate, suffering in some sort of situation, pain. I mean, the three of swords is pain. Heartache. Grief, grieving over a loss of somebody that you were in a relationship with. And this could be a family member. It is definitely a loss. I can't. I'm sorry. Damn it. It's a huge one, too. It is a big one. It's like they're taking it away because it's not meant to, it's not meant to be in your future. And you have to accept it. Yes, it hurts. It does hurt. So you're going to be putting in effort to release by the looks of things. And to regain your energy. And to regain your confidence. So I think in six months from now, you're going to be putting in effort to let go of this painful relationship that has slipped away. It is definitely a time of recuperation. There's no doubt about it. I don't, I don't, I don't see you uh, mastering your emotions all that well. I'm sorry, but I am not going to fluff it up. But I do feel like you guys will gain. I mean, yeah, it's going to be emotional, very emotional by the looks of things. The Knight of Cups reversed, the Chariot reversed, the Queen of Cups reversed. I think in the Three of Swords, and yes, it is definitely going to be emotional. But you are going to get past this. You are, and you will, you will gain control. You will, and it's like this puts you in boss mode, okay? They, now you're the boss. Now you're in control. This loss puts you in the leadership position, okay? It does. Now you're the boss. Now you're in control. So, yes, there's a loss, but, and it hurts really bad, but now you're the boss. This loss makes you the boss, I'm sorry. You may be dealing with the Queen of Pentacles. Now, the Queen of Pentacles is stable, solid, secure, um, valuable, knows her value, holds on to her value. And that may be who you are becoming if you are the feminine. The Queen of Pentacles is strong. Okay, she's very strong. And she can come off as cold, kind of like you, because... She knows her value, and a lot of people don't don't understand what their value is. But you only learn your value through pain, right? You, if you if you give your value away too easily, then you know that's when you get hurt. So this is a this is the queen of value, um, very hard worker, very generous, very capable, very abundant, focusing on your home, focusing on your job. Um, taking care of yourself, getting grounded. This is also, this is a mother. This is a mother. She's a caregiver. She is definitely a caregiver. So she has a golden opportunity in her hand. She has something of value. 
She can help you. There is a queen of pentacles that can help you. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person may help you to see your value. So anyway, Libra, I feel like you are going to be feeling very emotional after a loss. And I think that you may have been bamboozled. Okay, we get to, when we when we get the uh, Knight of Cups in reverse. This is somebody who you know. This is your love bomber. This is your person who says all the right things, but they have no follow through. They don't last. Okay, so I it, or this is a relationship that wasn't true. Okay, it wasn't true love. It wasn't you know what they said it was gonna be, and now it's it's like a reality check. You know something gets stopped in its track, and it's sudden. I do think it's sudden, and now you got to deal with the pain of letting it go. So six months from now, you are going to be put in a leadership role, where now you are the boss. But getting there was very, 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 very painful. Some of you are going to be burying yourself in your job because of this. You are going to be climbing that ladder. Yes, you are to success. You are now going to be the boss. But this boss comes after loss. So anyway, that's what I got. Good luck, Libra.